little hint as to where we're at here there is uh one peso we'll get to the opener in a few minutes here once the sun comes up Five. Rosie, Rosie. Okay, we got a startling development here, guys. <coughs> Excuse me. This was a 20. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. There is two of them. Holy crap. Oh my God. Wow. Okay, let me get into uh, where I'm at here. I'm, uh, oh my God, that could be, oh my. Sorry about my language here. Look at that, oh my word. I don't even know what to say. Um, We'll do the opener in a minute here, but um, I'm on the beach in Mexico and I'm just doing in between the chairs at my resort. I've been out here 20 minutes. I found uh, maybe five pennies, a few pesos and an American dime. That is shocking. I don't even know what to tell you. I hope there's no, uh... oh my God, both of them. Wow. Oh, they're heavy too. I'm wondering if these are platinum. I don't know. Uh, I'm in beach, or uh, sorry, I'm in park mode in the dry sand here. I just wanted to uh, it kind of experiment this morning between park and beach and see if I could stay in park because beach misses a lot of uh, pesos and I like to leave uh, the pesos for the cleaner. I'm kind of blown away here, guys. This could be really good. That is a wedding set. Oh my goodness. So this is in front of my resort, so I can check at the uh, lost and found. I can ask at the lost and found. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's keep going. Another Roosevelt dime. I don't know what that is, but it sure looks like jewelry. Some kind of pin or something, or was that a ring that was, I don't know. I don't know, but that's jewelry number two. Stun's still not up yet. <laughs> I guess uh, five was uh, pretty early. Screaming 18 here. Try a live dig. Oh, of course it is. Zinker. See, that's how the live dig likes to curse you. You live dig it, you get a penny. You don't, you get this. Whatever that is. Is that a ring? I don't know. Still not light out yet. Okay. Something though. That was they were both 18s. Okay, we got a few targets here. 18. I see nothing. deeper one here eighteen okay hand to hand combat straight down Okay. Okay. Here we go again. American penny. I think the other one's a 16 here. Let's let me just fix this. I don't leave holes. This one's a 16. Kind of jumpy. Oh, <coughs> pardon me. Yeah, 
There it is, half a beaver tail. Too good to be true. Okay, first one of the day, that's a 10 peso. Boy, they ring up like a champ. Another 10 peso here. Sun's just starting to come up. Well, what do you know? Hello, old friend. Glad to see you. All right, time for the opener. Good morning, ladies and gents. Our dog here, welcome to the hunt. I am in beautiful Puerto Vallarta. Look at that, how gorgeous is that? Yeah, so I'm down here for a week and uh, I'm gonna smack it. Can do lots of detecting while I'm down here and, and also enjoy uh, this beautiful place. Sun just came up. I've already been out here for about three and a half hours. So I'm almost done for this morning. I've got, I'm gonna cover a little bit in between these chairs here. But uh, it is humid, like nobody's business. So uh, yeah, short hunts. I'll probably do morning hunts and then maybe evening hunts, that kind of thing. And uh, try and get it when it's the least hot out. And I'm definitely gonna hit the water. This is really good water hunting here, I can tell. Um, they just had a big storm, uh, I think it was two weeks ago. So there's probably lots of stuff turned up in the water. So anyway, I've got my strategy all picked out here and uh, we're gonna smack it. So uh, I don't know if we'll get anything else today. Maybe I'll continue this video on tonight or we might just call it hunt number one. Cause I am super excited to get back to the room and find out what those rings are. All right, back to it. Eighteen to twenty-one. You just rake this, so I'm trying to be respectful. Of this uh, that is another ten. All right, there's lots of coins here. Um, this uh, in by the uh, resort here is not the best because there's very little sand. But we're going to keep hitting it. And we also got those rings out of this same spot. So, yeah. Twenty-five in the... Oh, maybe it's a little deeper. Sounds like ten pesos. It's got to be right on the surface. Let's go hand to hand. Put a uh, tether on my pinpointer so I don't leave another one in Mexico. Oh, there it is. Liquor cap. Okay, we're out uh, at night here on the same day. Gonna give it an hour or two, see what we can find. Okay. Five pesos. Wonderful. Okay, that rang up terribly. That is another one peso. Boy, these are uh, these are uh, very similar to Canadian money. The way they're ringing up. All right, let's keep going. Kind of a junky eighteen here. Sounds better now. All right, we got her. Oh, what is that? Oh boy. Oh, wow. Okay, there's lots of people sitting kind of behind me here, so we're just gonna put that straight in the pouch. Wow. Holy crap. Okay, that's beautiful. Why so junky though? That should have rang up great. I don't know. Okay, it's pretty good weight. Put that in a good pouch and we will carry on. It is humid. Oh, nice high tone here. I'm gonna say 10 pesos.
Oh, okay. America Penny. Okay, we got something here. I actually thought I was digging a coin. It was kind of a low tone. It's a little bracelet. Isn't that nice? Okay, we'll check that in better light. Got a heck of a day going here. I'll say that for day one. 15 to 18 here. I just pulled up in front of a new resort here and it's uh, got a lot of targets. Okay, I think that's one. Okay, so. No idea what this is. Oh, what is that? What on earth? Oh, it's fuzzy on that side. I have no idea what that is. It's jewelry though. Okay. I'm afraid to ask what that is, to be honest. Why is it fuzzy? Ew. All right. Oh, I like where this is headed. That was a nine. The, I'm still in front of the same resort as the ring and the bracelet. It is just full here. Especially if you want to dig these lower tones because that's where the rusty ball caps or bottle caps hit too. Okay, that's a good find. It's actually got some weight to it too. Very nice. All right, I'm almost done for the night. Been out about two and a half hours and I'm sweating like a bandit. What's that mean? I can't. Treasure. <laughs> All right, I thought that was gonna be a pull tab. It's a pair of uh, destroyed glasses. Fun. All right, ladies and gents, welcome to the wrap up. Wow, what a great start. Day one. Uh, there's quite a bit of hunting in there. We did two probably three and a half four hour shifts. So Yeah, we, we did good. It was a lot of fun. The weather's gorgeous. It's hot and humid, but um, it's beautiful So let's get on to the wrap-up. Mud Bunny's here He's got a sombrero He's having a little siesta I think right now um, So let's get on to it. Uh, the clad or pesos 38 pesos. I'm gonna run some tests uh, because I'm not getting this the uh, smaller denominations very well, so I'm gonna see what mode hits them the best I have a feeling that they're uh, iron Iron targets, so uh, yeah, I'll figure it out so that we can get more and what we're gonna do with the coins this time um, I usually leave them for the cleaner, but I thought that um, since the guys are out raking those um, beaches every morning uh, it's probably good for the metal detecting community if I give them the coins and I believe the resort all splits the tips anyway So we're gonna give them a big bag of coins at the end and uh, hopefully they'll uh, be happy to see metal detectors the next time So let's get on to the wrap-up uh, You know what? Let's go straight to the elephant in the room. I Am not gonna lie. I thought we paid for the trip with these two It is uh, so this one here you can tell on the back there's copper there. So that is a heartbreaker. I probably should have known because that diamond is uh, obnoxiously huge or the stone in there. I think it's just glass. But anyway, they are blingers. Uh, it's hard, very rare to find a wedding set as it is, let alone uh, a bling wedding set. But uh, it was exciting, so no big deal. I'll dig the blingers all day. And we got a pile of scurvy dogs there. 
my old buddy. That's an English pound there. That's awesome. 1970, I think, English pound. Two Rosies. Uh, we did those rings. This one here is a blinger as well. I believe it's stainless steel. And uh, this one here, I think, is an earring. And it is marked 925. A little bit of silver there. Uh, this one is gold. We found some gold on day one. I had a feeling it was going to be. It just looks pretty good. I think that's rose gold on there. It's not huge. It's probably going to be about a gram. But uh, very cool to find some gold. It is marked 10K TUR, which I'm going to guess means turkey. This thing, I have no idea what it is. It's got like a pendant on the top and then kind of like a little sock or something on there. I don't know if that's something to do with aromatherapy or something like that. But it is what it is. And the silver bracelet, really cool silver bracelet. That is 925 silver. So that is the hunt. We're going to be back out on the beaches. Uh, I'm going to have to uh, do a, quite a bit of night hunting on this trip um, just because you got to beat the heat. And I like to hunt in the morning and the evenings, and then that uh, leaves time to do other things during the day. So that is hunt number one. Stay tuned. We're going to do some more beach hunting first thing tomorrow morning. And uh, we're going to try the water here too. So that's the hunt. Thank you all so much for joining me. See you on the next one. Siguiente carta. El bando de los.